Hello and welcome, this is Neil Napier and in this video I'll give you a walkthrough of Curation Lab, show you what it does, how it does and how you can use it. So let's get started first by showing you some of the results of Curation Lab. So if you've been able to curate content from multiple different places and post it on our Facebook pages, LinkedIn profiles, Twitter feeds and of course our blog as well. So all this content that you see over here has been curated from multiple different sources and it's good because this way we don't always need to populate content from scratch for our own social media assets and blogs. So all of this, well, I can't log in here right now, all of this as you can see has been created using or rather curated using Curation Lab. But let me show you exactly how the process works. Before I get into it, I want to walk you through all the different places that you can integrate with. So we have integration available with social accounts as well as websites and then some other integrations as well and content sources that I'll show you in a second. So let's go ahead and check this out. You can integrate with your fan pages, your Twitter feeds and your LinkedIn feeds as well. So you can automatically curate content to those places. Then you can also integrate with your WordPress websites, Tumblr or Blogger. That's perfectly fine as well. Then we also have some link shorten capability. So say if you wanted to use bit.ly links when you post on social media, you can do that as well. I strongly recommend that because once you do that, you'll be able to also track how much traffic are you actually getting. And then finally, you have the ability to add content, content sources as well. So we already provide you, depending on the license you get, at least 100 sources, but you can add in your own as well to make sure that you're able to retrieve content from other places as well that we haven't covered. So all this is available to you within Curation Lab. Then what you can also do is you can add your own topics that you want to easily get content for. So for example, I would say in this case, health. And let's say I want article age to be a month. And let's go with this for now. I can add some websites as well and say save. Once you're done with this, then you can go ahead and click on discover and you can start discovering your content here. So immediately when you start out, you won't see all these posts. That's because we have created these topics. But when you go in, you will be able to see all the trending content that we have accumulated for you. And you can see all the Facebook shares they're getting, LinkedIn shares and Pinterest shares as well. And then you pick the one that you like the most. For example, if I like this one, I can click here to view it. And this opens up the content in a new window. I can then also click on post, share and save. Save is if you want to use it later on. So if I click on post, I'll show you what happens. Now you have the option of posting it on your website. So this is the content that we have picked up and we have the option to posting it on our website. Then click on next and you can pick the website that you want to post it to. And you can also choose to post it to your social media account. So you, I could say I'll post it on our All Dog Lovers fan page. When I'm done with that, click on next and then do it instantly or you can schedule it in advance. You can schedule it for another time as well. But I'm happy to post it instantly. So let's go ahead and do that and we'll come and check out the results in just a couple of minutes. See, the post has been made. Let's go and check this out. There, you can see our post has been made. And if I go back into Curation Lab and I'm going to just refresh this. There, you can see the JV blog post is made and then this is on our fan page as well. Let's go check it out. There we go. That's the post that we just made right now. You can of course edit it as well if you want to make a few changes before you post it. So this is it. That's how easy it is to use. If I quickly jump into health, which is a new topic that we added, you can discover all the content related to health there as well as soon as it becomes available and we sync it from the back and otherwise you can see we have some additional content here loaded from other keywords other niches like weight loss marketing gym news and so on if you wanted to actually publish your own content immediately from this platform you can do that as well i'll jump into publisher and let's go into new post there you go you can quickly publish a new blog post or social post right from here you can also schedule them as well or save them for future use. Then you also have reports here where you can see the engagement and traffic that you're getting as well as posts. The traffic we pick up is for the blog 
and then the posts you can see all the posts that have been made you can check them out all over here and you can also look at the engagement that your Facebook posts are getting. That's it. This is Neil Napier and I hope you enjoyed the demo of Curation Lab and I look forward to showing you more of this further down the line.